In today's video, I'm gonna share with you an important update on Cornerstone. And if you stick around to the end of the video, I'll share with you how I'm selling options on ARKK to buy OARK, just like we planned this weekend. So I earn over 100,000 per year in dividends at this channel. And my performance and value shows that we're up 47% for the year, 47%. The SP is up 16, the Dow is up six, the NASDAQ's up 30%. If you need help living financially free out of your brokerage account, email me for my e-guides at akintod48 at gmail.com. I have e-guides on Cornerstone and I have e-guides on Margin. Okay, I have four volumes of e-guides. Volume one, fundamental analysis. Volume two, technical analysis. Volume three is how to use margin to live financially free out of your brokerage account. And volume four is how to play Cornerstone properly. And I have an update on Cornerstone for you guys right now. So as you can see, yes, Cornerstone, it's my biggest position, 500,000 in this position. And what's special about Cornerstone for all you guys who don't know is Cornerstone is a five-star fund, okay? So if you think it's not good because you saw it on Portfolio Visualizer or Yahoo Finance, then you're mis led because it shows here on the Morningstar chart that it's beat the S&P over the last 10 years. So uh, to me, that's uh, really hard to beat, okay? It's hard to find a better investment than Cornerstone, okay? Five Star Fund pays you a 21% dividend, okay? And it drips its dividend down here at the NAV. So uh, you have a market price of eight, but you have the NAV price down here at 663. So that's a 26% gain. 652, 28% gain. 642, 30% gain. Down here at 627, that's a 33% gain. So we get these $1,000 gains each month from dripping our 21% dividend in Cornerstone down at the NAV, okay? Plus you get days gains potential. So we made another 1,000 in Cornerstone alone today. So that's why Cornerstone is so special, but you have to learn how to ask for the special drip and you have to learn how to time Cornerstone around its rights offering. Okay, uh, many closed-end funds do rights offerings every year. Cornerstone's no different, and it drops the price when the rights offering occurs. But I have a channel here on my Discord chat room that's dedicated to the RO announcement. Okay, so when Cornerstone gives its RO announcement, its rights offering announcement, I will alert you here on the Cornerstone RO. Okay, we also have other channels here on Discord. We're over 200 members strong. So um, Discord's free when you buy my e-guys, all right? So is my phone number. So that's the benefit of buying my bundle, okay? If you want to email me for my e-guides and ask for the pricing, I'll just tell you right now. The bundle is 200 for all four e-guides, my phone number, and Discord access to all of those channels. All those channels that you saw there are free. So uh, we all just kind of lean on each other every day. Um, I feel like there's an incredible value there. Even on my day trading section there, I have a channel there for day trading, which a guy named Carbon Zero um, has really good ideas in, okay, day, day trading strategies. This guy, Carbon Zero, I mean, I feel like he's, I mean, he's one of the best traders I've ever met. And I feel like there are other uh, Discord servers and other chat rooms that's dedicated to trading alone that aren't as good as the content he puts out. So Discord just has uh, an amazing array of resources, and I learn some from it every day too. All right, so Cornerstone, the announcement I want to share with you is that, yes, it had its X date, and a lot of people were emailing me about this today, like how to play the X date. Well, you have to be in the fund on or before the, the X date. So you had to be in this fund yesterday to qualify for the dividend. A14 is the X date. And look at how it gaps down, okay? See see this big, even though it was up today, okay? Um, I believe what, CLM was up today. Both of them were up. I, I made $1,000 in these funds today. Uh, but they gap down overnight. See this gap down there? You know, gap down right there. So this is normal. This is what happens when most, and when any stock has a dividend, it drops by the equivalent amount of the dividend. So this is normal. When you look at my performance and value tomorrow, you'll see that it'll drop by two percentage points because every 4,000 down in my account is 1%. So since we lost 10,000 day in the account, okay, we're, we're down to 480, right? Because the market's pulled back from the highs. We were at 500,000. We were at 50% for the year. We we're, were at 500,000 net account value and we had 1 million purchasing power. Okay, now that's all come down recently as the market's pulled back, which I did a video on this weekend. And um, now we're down another 10 today because of that cornerstone uh, X date. So tomorrow, that this 47% will drop to about 45%. Okay, uh, but no big deal. We're still blowing away all the other indexes. Okay, so 
Um, you know, to me, this is how to really outperform the market. You buy Cornerstone, you, you, you buy it before the rights offering, obviously. And uh, you not only live financially free out of your brokerage account, getting a 21% dividend, but you drip that dividend down to the nav and it helps you outperform the market as a result, especially when you use margin, okay? When you use margin like I use, just a fraction of the margin, okay? For every $1 you put in your account, you get $4 of purchasing power, okay? So I just use a fraction of that number to uh, get ahead, to get the dividends that you're seeing of over 100,000 per year and to get that performance of 47% uh, being up for the year. So, um, okay, now moving on to the ARC uh, part of the video, okay? How did I lower my margin debt, okay? Um, so what I did was I sold another put on ARKK. I told you guys I was gonna sell a put uh, on any more weakness. And so the first put I have on ARKK is a $50 strike price put, okay, right there, ARKK, and I receive $1,000 for it. So that knocked down my margin by $1,000. But then I sold another put today, which by the way, $50 strike price minus 10, that means my cost basis is 40. So that means we're still up on the position. Even though it shows we're down 225, we're actually up because ARC is around 42 or 43 a share. So the next put I sold today on the on the strength, right? Because if the market's going down, that's strength when you sell put options, okay? You wanna sell when things are falling, sell put options when they fall, when the premiums are highest. So 45 strike price, look at my premiums here. I got another uh, approximately $1,000. So now my new cost basis in this fund is 45 minus 10. So that's 35 strike, uh, 35 cost basis. Let's go look at a chart of ARC and I'll show you why I chose these premiums, okay? Because they're, they, they are strategic points on the chart, okay? That's why I chose the premiums. So if we go to the chart, you'll see here the support is 40. That's my first area that I sold my first put on, if you remember, at $50 strike price, $10 premium. So my cost basis is 40 on my first um, tranche of, of puts of a put that I sold in ARKK. The next put I sold in ARKK, now we're down at 35. So if we if we, you know, because of 45 minus 10, that's 35 cost basis. So if we were to reach 35, that'd be the May lows. That would be an absolute gift if I got a sign there. I don't think we're going to get there. I showed you how all the holdings are looking constructive on the past video, the top 10 holdings. If you saw that video this weekend. So uh, the other reason why I like ARKK and selling puts on it rather than owning it outright. Well, because if you own it outright, there's no dividend. And also with ARKK, the maintenance is the biggest thing on it. Not only do I not have the fund because it doesn't pay a dividend, but because the maintenance is low. So I like selling the puts on ARKK because, well, since we don't have a dividend in it, then if you sell puts on ARKK, you get it at low maintenance. So if I type in ARKK in the box here, you'll see that its maintenance is 35%. Okay, look at this. A view maintenance requirement, 35. So for a risky fund, that's really low. So I'd rather I'd rather sell puts on this and control the the fund here, control the stock through the option and not own it outright because it doesn't pay a dividend. But if I sell the options on it, then it doesn't take up any of my equity. So at thirty five percent maintenance, it only takes up three hundred and fifty of my equity if I buy a thousand dollars. So that's the key. If you need help understanding maintenance, that's in my margin e guide. Email me there at akintod forty eight at gmail dot com. Uh, I talk about the power of maintenance in the in the margin e-guide and maintenance is the whole key uh, to my success of the channel okay that's how i'm able to have a couple hundred thousand in debt but still have such a high available withdrawal to play with because my equity is high because i buy low maintenance names that's of course why i'm in cornerstone too cornerstone is a 30 percent maintenance name okay i've showed you that in the past so uh, i guess that'll do it guys all right uh the x date and cornerstone this is all, all routine this is completely normal uh, here's the maintenance requirement for Cornerstone, 30%. So I can put 100,000 in Cornerstone and only 30,000 of my equity is taken up. This is the secret to getting ahead. Okay, you got to you know, have leverage, but you also uh, have to have low maintenance leverage, in my opinion. So that's what we did. Uh, all uh, business as usual in Cornerstone today, nothing unusual. It drops by the by the amount of the dividend each time. Um, you know, so my account fell, but that's the way it goes. It should continue its march up to 30% premium soon. Here we are, Cornerstone premium check here, 27%. So when we get to 30%, look out for the rights offering. It may not happen, but that's when you start uh, looking for the announcement, which again, I'll post on Discord. 
and uh, you guys will have the alert there. So that's how we're playing OARC and selling options to not only buy more OARC, but um, help lower my margin in the process. So uh, if you need um, more help, you know, living financially free out of your brokerage account, email me for my e-guides at akintop48 at gmail.com. Again, you get free Discord access and my phone number, okay, which is an incredible value in my opinion. No other channels can offer such a value. And please, when you do email me, just be ready to buy. If you don't want to buy, then just don't email me, okay? Because it takes a lot of time and energy to answer all your guys' emails and comments. So uh, time is money. Please uh, understand that. So really appreciate you guys watching. Click like or subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll talk to you soon. Thanks.